right guys, so we're going to some place called Delhi Cravings that Kel just found because apparently it sells Brazilian food, authentic Brazilian food that's been imported from Brazil, huh? Yeah. And Kel's pretty excited. She started screaming whilst on the computer in the lounge room and is like, you have to come with me. You gotta take me. It's open. It's open. <laughs> Even though it's Anzac Day, it's open. We need to go. We need to go and get food. I need you to try my, the food of my people. You need to try it. Try the food. Try the fucking food, Pete. She didn't say that. She was a little calmer, just slightly. Let's see. All right, so we're here in this little, I don't know what you'd call this place, like mall, there's uh, shops open everywhere. Even though it's Anzac Day today, so they should be closed, but obviously they don't care, they don't give a shit. Here we go, here's the place. Straight ahead and on your left. Yeah. Can you see it? Yeah. Nearly. Yeah. <laughs> oh, I don't know what this is, but we're gonna try it. <laughs> Wish I could show you Kel's face now, guys. She's like a kid in a candy store. So there's lots of foreign food here, it looks amazing. Pasakinha is another one. I have no idea what it is, but apparently we're gonna try it. Caralho, goiabada. Goiabada, bicho. I know pau de queijo. Pão. Pão, not pau. Pau de queijo. Oh, too funny. I can't take everything. I have to choose. No, you're gonna have to be selective. Yeah, probably don't need goiabada. You don't need that one? Um, I love it. I have no idea what all this is, but I'm looking forward to eating. Tapioca. Ooh. Tapioca. Another one I just put some on? Yes. Batata. Batata palha. Oh yeah, you guys love that. They're like little chips, aren't yes. they? And I know farofa. I always was like, what is it? Rice? Or is it um, couscous? Is it something else though, right? Farofa. Tradicional. Oh, Kel just lost this shit. She was showing me this early today. There you go. Brazilians in Canberra. This is where you need to come. So Kel has stocked up, guys. Stopped up. Here we go. <laughs> How's it going? Hello. Would you like a bag? Yes. Yes, please. please. <laughs> How's your day going? Busy? Um, actually, busier than we expected. Yeah. Yeah, we didn't expect you guys to be open. Yeah. yeah. She well, lost her. Shit. She found all this Brazilian traditional food online and was yeah. like, "We need to go to this store." <laughs> <Really>? <laughs> yeah, she yeah, she's been here for so two years Brazilians. and she hasn't yeah. had any of this, and she's just like, "Oh, that's oh, awesome." <laughs> All right, guys, we've stocked up. We have stocked up. We have like 40 bucks worth of <laughs> Brazilian food, which doesn't amount to much once it's been imported here to Australia. But it's going to be an interesting experience to see what this is like. Um, I haven't had any traditional Brazilian food that's actually come in packages or anything, right? We've made a few things like brigadeiros. And that was about it. Yeah, Probably. and now, um, hekejão. Hekejão, We also had hekejão. So, this is going to be good fun, guys. This is going to be good fun. I have no idea what to expect. In fact, I think I do know what to expect. A lot, a lot of sugar. <laughs> I reckon it's going to be sugary as <laughs> So, I am here today testing Brazilian food. What's the first one that's coming my way? You. I gotta say it, alright. Yeah. Tradição brasileira. Yeah. Pasoquinha. Perfect. Pasoquinha. So what is this exactly? Pasoquinha, or do you want me to eat it first and then you'll tell me? Um, this is, uh, yeah, go for it. <laughs> Smell it. It looks like these are little cylinders. Little cylinders. They kind of remind me of um, those apricot treats that you can get in Australia. Have you ever seen those with like coconut on the outside? No. They're really sweet, but I can already smell... The sugar? <laughs> I can smell now the peanut butter. All right, so this is pasaquinha. Pasaquinha. <laughs> it 
is very sweet. Very rich. Really, really sweet. You could never go through a whole one of those. No. No, really, I don't find it really sweet. Well, it's really sweet. It's not what I was expecting. Really? I was, ex I was expecting it to be more peanut buttery and really dense. Because those apricot things that I have in Australia, mm. those apricot things are really, really dense and chewy. So I was expecting it to be like that, but this feels like it's kind of powdery as you bite into it, but it was very nice, very sweet. Wow, so this is the inside of it. <laughs> yeah, oh my God. I could have one of those, I think. Oh, <laughs> they're really strong. Can I get a glass of water? Yes. <laughs> so that I can wash my mouth out. It's very powdery. It sticks all over my mouth. Yeah. Alright, I've cleansed my mouth and I'm ready for the next one. So what's next? Bis. Bis. These Which look means... like waffle biscuits. Yeah. We used to have these with my um, my grandmother loved these things, but they would be like pink or yellow. Ah, okay. When they would come out, she would bring them out when I would go to her place. So yeah, I think you can probably get these in Australia, though I haven't seen like them. I haven't seen them like this. All right. So what are these? Bis Nova Formula. Well, look out, new formula, guys. Lacta. That tells me there's milk in it. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Oh, the packaging looks a lot nicer than the Australian ones. The Australian ones, you'd pull it out of here and they would just be sitting there mm. ready to come out. So wow. Bees so that's... It's like again. Look at that. So, você pediu um bis, it, uh, it was like you want something to happen again. So, okay. if you're singing, I'm like, oh, um, bees, it's like, oh, sing again. Ah, okay. So, yeah. you get it. Yeah. So, this is it's tiny. I was expecting it to be much bigger based on what I was looking at here. It's a bit of False advertising there. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so let's give this a go. Kel's getting into it. You haven't had one of these in a while? In a long time. <laughs> Holy moly. All right, so here we go. They look pretty good. They look like, um, oh, there's some chomp bars that you can get in Australia that look like this. They're called chomps and they've got caramel in them. They're really good. All right. Yeah, those are good. I could eat a lot of these. <laughs> That's <busy. laughs> Yeah. Mmm, so good. I think I need a second one, just to be sure it's what I'm tasting. <laughs> <laughs> what are these, like the um, Brazilian version of Tim Tams? <laughs> yeah, yeah, but Tim Tams are extremely sweet for me. Wow, yeah, they're good, I really like those. They, they're just those waffle biscuits, you can definitely find those all around Australia, but they seem to come differently, they'll be thin, mm. but I think they've obviously used the same stamp, because uh, they have the same patterning. What's next? Guarana. 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 So the funny thing was Kel showed me today this morning. She's like, have you ever tried Guarana? Which is like the Brazilian version of um, Coke, right? Like no, we it's have sugary. Coke. You've got Coke, yeah. but it's your a special it's our Brazilian. Main, yeah. Original do Brasil. Yeah. Original, original do Brasil. Original, the original from Brazil. This is Guarana. Antarctica. All right. So it contains caffeine. Cuidado. Watch out. <laughs> yes. And what is guarana exactly? Is it's the, berry? the fruit. Yeah. yeah, the thing. Yeah. So I've never tasted the fruit. I've never had one of these, but I always hear Brazilians talking mm. about it. So let's, this one was nice and cold in the fridge when we got there. Opens like a normal yeah. can. <laughs> it smells like a normal drink. Yeah. <laughs> All right, I'm guessing it's going to be green or yellow. Oh, nailed it. So do I just do a little bit? Yeah, you can. All right, let's just leave that there. All right. Ooh, oh, very, it smells very arama uh, aramaic. Well, I'm not American. Aromatic, mm. aromatic. Lots and lots of um, just have fruits, a, yeah. A lot. Have a lot? Yeah. It's okay, just is this going to blow my mind? Yeah. <laughs> That's pretty good. It's hard to describe though, because it's kind of like a fizzy drink, yeah. soft drink, but it's fruity. It's nowhere near as sweet as I was expecting. Oh, good. I was expecting that to look like Mountain Dew or something, you know, just based <laughs> on this and being like, oh my God. But it tastes exactly like diabetes. How much sugar does that actually have in it? Oh, it's only 10 grams, 10%. I don't know what Coke is, but I think Coke's way more than 10%. So it's actually quite good. Keep smashing that. All right, so these are the other two things that yeah. Kel wanted to show me. Nescau. 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 Which is this our looks Milo, like chocolate but better. Drink. Yeah, your Milo, but better, huh? Much better. <laughs> 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 mm, I 
Oh, this looks pretty good. The other thing that I noticed before Kel noticed was farofa, farofa, which is what exactly? A sava flour, did you say? Yeah, yeah, A sava flour with these ingredients mixed in. And so you have this as a side. Yeah. And initially I thought it looked like, oh, is that like rice or something? Like mm -hmm. looks like couscous, but apparently it's not. No. You wouldn't have that much of it, right? It's just kind of a, a yeah. little ad additive. Yeah, that's it. You described it perfectly. <clears throat> All right, well, I guess <laughs> we will have that tonight and hopefully I can video that and include that, guys. Anyway, see you at dinner time, guys. Alright guys, we're back, it's dinner time. Kel's cooked this nice little meal. We've got some black rice here. And then, what would you call this, Kel? This chicken? This herb chicken? Herb chicken, yes. Mmm. And also, excuse me, we have farofa. So, how do I eat this? What do I do with it? Um, do just, I just... You can try like that, but I think it would be a bit... Brutal? Yeah, just... Do I just put it no, over the top, just, on the yeah, side? Yeah, a little bit on the side, yeah. And then you can mix it with rice if you want. Okay, like... maybe I should, I'll get some of this rice and I'll try the try farofa. Alright, 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 all right. Actually, I might use a spoon. So I have no <laughs> idea what to expect. Is it good? Yeah. It's really dry and nice and salty. It's not bad, it's just... The texture? It's kind of like, it feels like they've gotten plain salty chips and put them in a blender. <laughs> and that's what you've, you've ended up with all these, this is what a packet of chips is like when it's, um, it's being yeah. ground up. See, <laughs> catch <laughs> mm. Yeah, I was expecting it to be like flour. Like chicken salt or something, very fine, but it's chewy. You, it can be a bit... Interesting, so far off, not bad. 